right, the next thing we're going to do is set the head up to, for welding. And we have the collet and the, uh, the stud holder and the piston rod and the feed tube already installed. We'll go over that later, how to install that for your application. But for now, to set up the, we're going to set up the plunge uh, distance or how far the penetration of the stud into the material. What I'm going to do is take the stud and feed it into the system. Then I'm going to put this machine in a certain mode here. Let me show this here. It's called a, it's in the operational mode now where this is what you used to weld, but we're going to put it in where it says mode lift. And this is the lift check mode. This allows the head to come down and do its, uh, go through its operation without actually welding. Now whenever I, if you look at this display here, it shows how far the shaft moves. And we want the shaft, whenever the weld head is down, to move up two millimeters. So what I can do is I can hold these two palm buttons down. The head will come down, it'll do a lift, and then it'll come back, and it'll rest. When it, whenever it stops, it's lift motion. That shows us our penetration, it's 1.6 millimeters now. So we want to set that to two millimeters. The way we do that is we adjust this uh, screw here at the bottom of the slide. This is a stop, so I can make it where it will go down a little bit more. So that's 2.5, it's a little bit too much, so I'll move it up a little bit. That's 2.2 millimeters, that's pretty close. You just have to make sure that you do this uh, with a stud installed in the stud holder. After that, you just tighten up this nut here that locks that, sets that stop in place, and you have the, the correct uh, depth then set on the weld head. Right, that's it, good enough.